Welcome to our crowdfunding page, and we're so happy you're here. The Feminist Library means so much to so many people, and it should mean something to you as well. The Feminist Library has been running in London since 1975, and all that time it's been run almost exclusively by volunteers. You don't have to have a card to come in. You don't have to be a member of an organisation. You know, people come together here to talk, to organise, to discuss. It's, it's radical, it's, you know, it's political. The Feminist Library is intersectional and inclusive. It welcomes people of all genders and it's trans inclusive. It's fantastic as a place to study or a place to research. Um, you need at least a whole day. Thousands and thousands of books and magazines and newspapers. I still get surprised by it I mean, every time I'm here. It's literally like I discovered something new. One of the most amazing things about the Feminist Library is our events programme. We run workshops, art exhibitions, discussions, readings and Spanish language and Latinx events. An incredibly precious community space, not just for women, um, but also for the local community and for activists more generally. And yes, it's an activist space. This year we're facing a new challenge. We need your support in order to move the library, which is a very expensive business. We're having to leave our current building that we've been in for more than 30 years as the council have decided to redevelop it. On the bright side, they have offered us a really lovely new building in Peckham, which we're hugely excited about. But we need to urgently raise at least £30,000 in order to turn that from what is currently an empty hall into a thriving real library. We're really excited about the potential of the new building. It's 50% bigger, which will allow us to expand the collection, expand our events programme. We have got a fantastic collective of architects who are helping us to turn that into a library. This crowdfunding scheme is absolutely vital to keep the library going. It's a great resource centre and many people get great enjoyment and are moved and touched by all the literature that they find here. The library doesn't receive any government funding whatsoever. We're completely dependent on the work of our volunteers and the financial support of a community of people who care about the library. If we want to carry on, we really need to raise this £30,000, otherwise we will have to close. We're really relying on the support of the community to help us to move. If we can't raise enough money, then basically we're in serious trouble. I think the Feminist Library is important because it's important that we understand how we came to have the liberties and the rights that we do have through the struggle of all the women and the sacrifices they made. It's so important to have this, to remind ourselves that women are valuable and that individual women are valuable and also as a group women are valuable so I think that you know we should we should strive to keep places like this open. The world is always such a man's space and being in a feminist space you feel like you can take up space it's your space and that is so so important because women don't get that enough. They want a world where equality is not an issue that it's it's just part of our, of our culture. Um, and in a world of ever-diminishing women's spaces, we need this one, so please donate to the Feminist Library because we can't exist otherwise. If you've got money available, then donate money. Because this is your library, this is your heritage. The women's consciousness as it's represented here is part of your consciousness. It's been the energy and passion of these many hundreds of volunteers that have enabled the library to survive this long and we are extremely keen that it should carry on surviving for at least another 43 years and it can only do that with your help. London needs its community spaces. It needs autonomous, feminist, LGBT and intersectional spaces. Already too many have been lost and closed down. We can't afford to lose any more. So please donate today. Help the Feminist Library get the new home it deserves.